All praises to Yahweh, Bashem Yahweh Bahashem, Rekad Kodash. Double honors to the elder apostles, great millstone who taught us this truth. Peace and salutations to the rest of the brothers throughout the four corners of the earth. And uh, this is the brother Milkama. And uh, I got a quick lesson. Uh, it's not going to be as long. You know, I just wanted to bring this information out. Uh, and um, I got one particular scripture. Uh, you know, it's which we all know it by now. But uh, I'm going to go ahead and let the video play. Lord willing, it's head to find it to the flock groups that of course usurp any form of legitimate government and of course in the western corporate media there's not a lot of talk about his connections to globalist his former doings at goldman sachs but as nbc news puts it he's the first british asian to assume the role of becoming the next british prime minister and of course his money his influence his connections his organizations that he's tied to will matter when it comes to the policy that he's going to be implementing as of course this is the man who's been the face behind the central bank digital currencies and its larger push that now as prime minister is probably going to realize a lot of his technocratic Orwellian wishes. The G7 is launching a set of public policy principles for retail central bank digital currencies, CBDCs. Central bank digital currencies could be a digital version of money, a bit like a digital banknote that could be used. And yes, our government could treat you like a slave peasant hoe, especially if you dare defy us and we'll turn off your bank inability even to make money. My goodness, one of the most dangerous things for personal liberty, for freedom, for, for capitalism, for free trade and expression is, of course, a government watching over every aspect of it. If you think taxes are bad now, if you think surveillance is bad now, if you think the state has too much power now, imagine if the state had the ability to be able to monitor every financial transaction and to be able to stop it at the whim of any moment and time that they choose to. And we have to... Hey, and that's what it's going to be. Uh, this is the book of Revelation, chapter 14, verse 9. It says, And the third angel followed them, saying with a loud voice, if any man worship the beast and his image and receive this mark in his forehead or in his hand, the same shall drink the wine of the wrath of the Most High, which is poured out without mixture into a cup of his indignation. And he shall torment, shall be tormented with fire and brimstone in the presence of the holy angels and in the presence of the Lamb. And this is what is, that's what's going to, you know, they, that's one thing they didn't mention in that. They didn't mention how this uh, digital current uh, system is going to be uh, actual, uh, you actually used, you know, what what's, what's the procedure and how you're going to use it. That's the only thing that's missing. They're telling you it's a, a you know, a, a digital blockchain or digital currency, but they're not telling you how it's going to be used or what device you're going to uh, have to use to, you know, be able to actually use this digital currency. Okay. Verse 11, in which we know that this is what this Mark is talking about. Verse 11, it says, And the smoke of their torment is sent it up forever and ever. And they have no rest day nor night who worship the beast in his image and whosoever receiveth the mark in his name okay of his name so this is going to be whoever receives this okay whoever receives this this uh karagma okay this is what's going to happen to you before the ultimate uh judgment of your how about shimi okay so i mean it ain't hard to understand the things that this 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 guy here uh uh we are 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 changed this is his platform and he's he broke it down you know he telling you what's gonna happen and that you're gonna be a perpetual slave okay and and the thing is and ultimately the most high tells you not to okay so hey this is the judgment of whoever takes this karagma okay so, hey, with that being said, we can go ahead and end it there. That's what I really wanted to say, all in a nutshell. So, uh, all praises to Yahweh, Bashem, Yahweh, Shai, Bahashem, Rekha, Kodash, double honors to the elder apostles, great millstone who taught us this truth.
Peace and salutations to the hopeful elect. Shalom.